The Neotome Alpha is a natural fit for SAMRI and CRIC as an advanced translational imaging centre and a long-term collaboration partner of Siemens. We're obviously focused on frontier imaging, but also bringing those uh, techniques to clinical patients. It's a, an example of uh, government and industry co-investing to achieve world-leading imaging infrastructure for South Australia. So this is um, a CT scanner. Uh, for me, it's really important because it can image uh, the heart in one heartbeat with uh, ultra high resolution. And this particular machine can do it even better um, in patients that have, um, are a bit older, have more calcium or have stents. Um, and also with the increased resolution, you can actually just get a better image at the smaller vessels. Uh, and at regions where you normally would be in doubt uh, in the setting of hardening of the artery, so-called calcification. Photon counting CT really enables us to be at the cutting edge of clinical research. It enables us to ask questions that we've never been able to ask before about what, what the plaque looks like in someone's coronary artery. You know, can we do better when we're dealing with rectal cancer and the diagnosis of rectal cancer? Can we do better in kids with lower radiation doses? Oh, I think it's been terrific that SAMRI has been able to show the leadership to the firstly develop the imaging centre itself, CRIC, and really bring that infrastructure to Adelaide and enable Adelaide to benefit from that from a medical research point of view and obviously from a clinical trials point of view. And now I think with our leadership, we're now putting into that facility the only um, photon counting CT in Australia and our researchers are really excited but even more important is all the other researchers in Adelaide and around Australia who are really excited about the opportunity to use this instrument. I think the photon counting CT is really a, a revolutionary step forward in terms of CT technology. Um, the image quality, lower radiation dose, uh, but the most exciting thing is that we're really just scratching the surface of what it's able to do. Um, as a really brand new technology in the CT space, in the radiology space, uh, the coming years will be a really exciting period of time as we discover uh, what its capacities are, uh, what it can do for patient care, for research. Um, you know, but my own area of specialty is in cancer imaging, um, and so to see the, uh, the new technology applied to that space will be really exciting, and I think it will provide the opportunity to uh, personalise uh, um, and focus patient care and to see radiology step into that place is a really exciting development.